YouTube today I'm here with a new tutorial and in this video I'm gonna show how to run Mac on Windows so friends as you can see currently I'm running Windows 7 and the version is Windows 7 ultimate powered by an Intel Core i7 processor and 8 GB of RAM so the advantage of this method is there is no compatibility I mean you can install Mac on minimum hardware configuration and the best point is it will run inside your windows so before starting if you haven't subscribed to our channel please go and subscribe to our channel for latest updates and stay connected so guys let's start to install mac on windows you will need few things an internet connection to download the required files like winrar vmware workstation mac os image file and the unlocker tool for vmware workstation and of course a windows pc or a laptop so firstly you need to install vmware workstation click on next accept the license agreement and click on install click on finish and the VMware workstation has been installed after installing VMware workstation you need to install WinRare if haven't and right click on Mac OS Sierra image and click on extract here and the Mac OS Sierra image file is being extracted so here is the Mac OS Sierra image file which I have been extracted and this is the VMware virtual disk image file so guys after unlocking the VMware workstation open VMware workstation and click on create a new virtual machine click on next and select I will install the operating system later and choose Apple Mac OS X and version 2 OS X 10.11 now you need to type the name of virtual machine you can type any name but for instance I am typing Mac OS Sierra 10.12 and click on next and choose store virtual disk as a single file and click on finish after that click on edit virtual machine settings select memory to 4 GB and remove and select hard disk SATA and click on remove then click on add and then select hard disk and click on next choose SATA and select use an existing virtual hard disk now you need to locate the extracted macro Sierra image file and click on finish after that click on ok and close VMware workstation because you need to add this code go to documents and open virtual machines right click on this Mac OS Sierra this is the name of your virtual machine right click on it and open with notepad go to last and paste this code then click on save and close notepad then again start VMware workstation and then power on this virtual machine now as you can see the Mac OS Sierra is being loading will take few minutes you don't need to worry you don't have to install the complete Mac OS Sierra you have to only configure it you have to select the country keyboard layout and create a user account and that's all you are ready to use Mac OS Sierra
now here is the welcome screen select your country now select your keyboard support now currently I am not having an internet connection click on continue click on continue continue and select the license agreement click on agree now it's time to create a user account Now choose your password. Enter the same password here. And then type any int. So as you can remember. Then click on continue. Select your time zone. click on continue click on continue now it is setting up your mac and wow here is the sierra welcome screen we have reached to our desktop now to enable full screen go to removal devices to SATA DVD and SATA click on settings and select use an IOC image file so here is the VMware tool open and click on ok then again click on connect so now install VMware tools so it will enable full screen resolution click on install enter your password Now close this and click on restart. Now after restarting Mac or Sierra, enter your password. Now click on full screen and here it is. Now you can run Mac or Sierra in full screen. So all things are working guys. Currently, I don't have an internet connection, so Siri is not going to work. Let's check the specification. So, here is the Mac OS Sierra version 10.12 Mac, processors 2 into 3.2 GHz, and that is unknown. 
and the memory is 4 GB of RAM and the graphics is display 128 MB so guys that's all hope you like this video please like share comment and don't forget to subscribe for more updates stay connected have a great day